What is up my clan? Welcome to Monday, day 1032. I'm here with the kids and we are walking right into a movie. We're gonna go see Paddington per Sierra's request. I wanted to go see that new magic one with the animation from LucasArts. That'd be next week's movie. It's Monday, which means Tiffany's already on her way to work or at work by now. At this point, she's at work. And uh, so it's movie Mondays. Me and the kids going to see movie. Are you excited? Yeah. Are you? Are you? Are you? Sierra, are you excited? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's movie Mondays. Let's go, let's go, let's go. All right, Bryce is gonna try and get a minion. A little mini minion. Get him, get him, get him. Yeah, I think that's pretty much impossible. Two claws, how are you supposed to get anything with two claws? Come on now. All right, boys and girls, all done with the movie and we are here at Hobby Lobby because I told Sierra that she needed a portfolio for her awesome drawings and artwork that she does. Because she just drew, she just finished the, the, that dinosaur drawing. I don't think you guys, have you, guys told, have you told them about the dinosaur drawing? No, I don't think so. I'll show you guys when we get home. Yeah, so while, uh, while I was gone, she picked up a book uh, from the library at uh, how to draw like 50 animals. And it's like step by step how to draw these animals. And she drew me a dinosaur and it's awesome. Background with like volcano and palm trees and everything. And I was like, this is really good. And she goes, do you wanna put it on the wall or do you wanna do something? I go, no, no, no. When you do something that awesome, you need to put it in your portfolio. And of course, I had to explain to her this morning what a portfolio was and what, what, what not. And so I said, you know what, let's go to Hobby Lobby and get you a portfolio to start keeping all of your awesome artwork. Because she's drawn so many things and painted so many things and they get like thrown away or put away and, and forgotten about. And I was like, no, you need to start keeping track of this stuff. So here we are. All right, here we go. Look at all the different por art portfolios they have here. All the way from 14 by seven, all the way down to eight and a half by 11. And you, Pretty much draw on regular size paper, right? Yeah. So eight and a half by eleven would probably work. We're gonna go one size bigger, just so she has room for the paper. That'll hold twelve. It has twelve sleeves, so you can put like twenty-four drawings if you do back to back. Uh huh. And then oh, like. Should I, should I get like the clear? That way I can like write my name on it, and so you can see. But you can do stickers on this. Stickers. You can put like Where stickers. I can put my te uh, the Tetris block mm -hmm. stickers. Mm -hmm. I can't. Well, I can't. She do these. Why can't she put stickers on these? The black would look better with the stickers. So I decided I wanted the black one because it looked cooler, but I still kind of wanted to like put my name on it and like something like that. So I'm either gonna do like like foam stickers, or I might find like a gold or like white marker to write my name on it and decorate the folder. Yeah, I, I told her I kind of like the idea with the stickers, like with the like letter stickers, because then like you know it can be colorful and and all the different colors. She's not gonna be able to put, like take a marker and draw on it. She won't be able to do that. The markers, colored markers won't come through. If she wants to do markers, she should go with the clear or white one. But, she, but I agree, the black does look better. So that's why I'm, I'm recommending the stickers. And there's all these different shapes, like foam ones. These ones here that have glitter on them. She likes some of the glitter. Yeah, because I think they're That's the thing like... too, is like you can get different stuff too. Like you could get like fish and stars and yeah. cars and I can get Ninja Turtles. Butterflies. Right, Bryce? Speaking of Ninja Turtles, what, what shirt are you wearing? Booyah! Look at that. This is when you were three years old. Yeah, that's when I was three years old. You're right, but look at that. Those are old school Ninja Turtles. The Ninja Turtles I grew up with. That's what they look like. Ah. Defend yourself, boy. Ah. I am the master. Yeah! I didn't break it. I didn't do it. I didn't touch anything. I'm out of here. All right, what did you decide on? I found these Sharpies with gold, silver, and bronze. Gold, silver, and bronze. I like the bronze. Yeah, I like or the... Or copper. I like, I, I, I'm gonna call it copper. I like the gold. I like the gold? Yeah. That should work pretty good. Permanent markers on that should work very, very nicely. Holy crap, guys. I have never, ever in my life seen an actual 68 Plymouth Roadrunner. That is my dad's car right there. I've seen 69s, I've seen 66s, I've seen 70s. I've never seen the actual year, make and model of my dad's car. It's even the same color, look at that. 
All right guys, one last pit stop before we head home and it is back to Staples to pick up one last item for my office. Well, I can't really say it's the last item because I need a lamp too. But when Tiffany and I were out shopping, we we found one of these uh, floor mats for my chair and we wanted one, we just didn't know what size to get and now I know what size to get. And it's these bamboo, purely bamboo chair mat. It rolls out, look at it, and it's dark cherry wood. And 45 by 52 is the size that we're gonna get. And they have them. There it is. Booyah! Oh, Bryce, is it as tall as you? Or are you taller? Oh, you're barely taller. No, it's his hair. That's his hair. Oh, just, <laughs> no, it's his forehead. I can see his forehead. Well, guys, got it home and uh, got the mat on the ground. It looks awesome. Check it out. It's dark. It matches the desk. Chair rolls on it a little bit, but... As usual, something I failed to do at the store, and I'm, you know, I kind of blame Tiffany, too. She didn't look at it. She didn't notice it either. But on the side of the box, it says right here, Perfect for commercial carpet, up to a quarter inch thick, no carpet pad, or hard floors, and hard floors. Meaning, it's designed for that really thin carpet that's just like carpet on top of cement, like commercial carpet, or hardwood floors. Obviously, because this is a house, it has a carpet pad, and so as I'm rolling my chair across it, I can like, I feel it like starting to bend the wood a little bit, and yeah. I can see it not working very good on the carpet. So, as much as we love the looks of that dark cherry wood all, matching all this, I'm most likely going to take it back and just get a hard, clear plastic one. All right, there's Sierra's final product on her Profolio. God, I hope that's spelled right. <laughs> it is. I, I love it. art. I looked at it on the I love art. Art in the heart. Very nice, very nice. So I looked at the back. Profolio. Yeah, but that might be the name of the company though. Okay, so we were in the store and we were saying, because the sticker on the thing said Art Profolio. And I'm like, I don't think that's right. I've always, I, thought it was, I thought it was always Portfolio. And uh, we're like, all right, well maybe we've been saying it wrong. Because that happens, right? You'll say a word forever and you think you know the name of the, the, this, the pronunciation of a word. And we're like, oh, maybe it is Profolio. And then like, I'm looking, I'm like, that doesn't look right. I'm almost positive it's Portfolio. So of course we pull up Google and Google says, I start typing Art. P, O, and pfft, Art Portfolio comes up. I'm like, ah, oh, see babe, it is Art Portfolio. So I'm like, what's Profolio? It's the brand of the pro portfolio that we bought her. In Itoya Art Profolio. <laughs> hmm. So there's a label right there on the bottom. That's the name of the company. It's a Profolio Expo. <laughs> so this is Sierra's Profolio. Technically it is. That's right, we all it's know a, where it is. It's a Portfolio though. Like it's it a is. Portfolio You're right. brand. You're right, so. it is. So earlier at Hobby Lobby, I was telling you guys that I had a drawing with a dinosaur. And so I thought I would show you since I told you. So here it is. So this is the dinosaur. I've got some trees. This is the volcano right here. I used like red orange or orange red. I, I don't know what color it was called, but it was something like a like a red and an orange mixed together. But um, see, I used that and then I added some red to it because it was too orangish. So I added some red to it. Then I added a little bit of like a goldish yellow. And then I added some black if you can see it. There's a little bit of black in there because it's supposed to be like rocky, like rocks falling into the lava. So I added a little bit of black to it. I have a blue sky. Nice golden sun. It's kind of hard to see in this lighting, but it's more of a yellow. It's kind of like a darker yellow that I used in this. Um, I've got a little squirrel hiding from the big dinosaur. And then the grass. Yeah, that's my... Focus. There's... So yeah, there's my drawing that I was talking about. Tomorrow, busy day. I'm going out and about for most of the day. I will uh, meet up with a friend for Taco Tuesday and then hanging out at a coffee shop where I will be ending my night with a WordPress meetup. So stay tuned, lots going on. We'll see you then. Vlog on. Well, there you go, guys. I thought this was gonna be a short vlog, but apparently I did a great job of vlogging while we were out and about. And so it's almost 10 minutes, just about 10 minutes there. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. I did spare you guys from the boring blah 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 of my morning working at home with the desk and the office and whatnot. I just, just hustle, hustle, hustle. I'm gonna try that out. I'm gonna try like 
just working during the day while the kids are in school, unless I've got something going on, there's really no reason to pull the camera out and just talk to you guys just for the sake of talking. I'll wait till the kids get home, we do fun stuff. Uh, on the screen, two more really cool videos. One year ago, uh, we went to, uh, to the arcade and did some pizza bar pizza and played some games and everybody came to my house and we hung out and um, had a really good time with a bunch of people over here. Two years ago, Bryce had a basketball game. We go to Gangplank Avondale for some Lego Mania and then we end the night uh, at Jack and Chrissy's with Mike and Joy. So check those out. Annotations are clickable links in the description down below. Be sure to follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Vine, Snapchat, and Glide. I am putting my link down in the, in the description for Glide. I just started using Glide a little bit. It's a way for us to video chat, guys. I love it. It's awesome. If you have it, add me, and we'll do a little video chat back and forth, and uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye!